right? The magic of guitar looping. It is here, we all love it, right? So this guitar loop starts with an ostinato. A short repeating melodic phrase in the entire loop, like this. Very short. <laughs> Very ambiguous, this can go anywhere, right? So in the next four layers, I'm slowly spelling out a chord progression, with each layer adding more and more texture to the sound. And as a cherry on the cake, I'm ending with the bass line. Let's go. as well. And for this loop I'm using just two. Just a D and an A. It fits the entire chord progression which is basically D, F sharp minor, B minor and A. Something I also love is adding different instruments to a loop like a drum machine, percussion or whatever you've got lying in the attic. And you can get a lot of cool things out of the guitar as well like smacking on the guitar and things, but this is also fun. So let's see if we can pull something off. the listener to actually recognize some things it could be great to add a hook in there a strong melody people can sing or can hum along to um, this makes it so much more recognizable so let's see if we can craft something that people can sing along to i'm singing to forgive me
everyone sings along, right? Join the party. Okay, um, and did you ever hear about Chekhov's gun? Uh, Chekhov's guitar, I should say. If there's a guitar on screen, it should be played. Why even bother putting it there in the first place if you don't play it? Of course, playing the acoustic. It's a beautiful, beautiful instrument. So uh, I'm thinking campfire vibes and sheer vibes. Just play some cool strums. So I'm going to try to harmonize the melody to enforce that sound. But before we go there, this loop is actually based on one of the loops from my new guitar course, Loop School. In the course I'm going over everything that makes a loop great. In the heart of the course there's eight epic guitar loops, just like this one, and almost everything can be played with just a guitar and a simple looper. So although I'm adding things here and there, it's definitely not necessary. All the layers come with tabs and detailed instruction videos so it's easy to follow along. We start out with the basics from looping, from buying, setting up and using the pedal to everything that can come up in your looping journey, like hooking up different instruments to your looper. Anyway, I'm super excited for it. I put months and months of hard work into the course and I think it turned out as a great resource for everyone that's into looping or wants to be into looping. So check out loopschool.com more information I really think you'll enjoy it. So now it's time to lessons for the melody. of guitar looping, all the creativity you can put in, so it uh, definitely feels rewarding. Anyway, I hope you check it out, loopschool.com, and thank you so much for watching, it's really appreciate it. Tabs for this loop are available on my Patreon page, you can check it out. All the links are below. And thanks for watching, have a lovely day. Cheers! Cheers.